Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play The Binding of Isaac Afterbirth. I'm Nye, and I... I feel like playing The Lost. Let's play The Lost. Okay, so... This is gonna be our Deal with the Angel run. Uh, so what that means is that we're gonna have to actually get Deals with the Angels. I can't do Deals with the Devil. On the plus side, I can take my time. Uh, we don't have to move quickly now. Um, we've done all of our stuff. So, we can take our time, move slowly, um, you know, get the bonuses that we need to get. Uh, that's, so, I'm actually looking forward to this. I actually, now that there's, now that we have the, uh, Holy Mantle and the Lost, I actually kind of like the Lost. I think it's a lot of fun. The only thing I don't like is that, you know, because we have to get, um, into the Mega Satan run, I can't just randomly take deals with the Devil. What I'm really hoping for is that we get to either get out of jail free card or dad's key so that way I can. But um at the moment I don't have the ability to take uh deal with the devil. So Dr. Fetus. That's an interesting uh pickup here. And I'm not gonna say no to it. I don't see the fetus items that much anymore. And Dr. Fetus actually requires a little bit of skill. Um, unlike Epic Fetus, which is uh I'm not gonna say a no skill item, but it doesn't require a ton of skill. Um, well, I mean, maybe it does a little bit more nowadays, but it didn't back, uh, in the first game, and I kind of grew to dislike it because of that reason. Okay. So maybe I don't need to worry about damage after all. Okay, well, that's a... Oh! Okay, yeah, so... That was weird. Um... So, so that was something weird happened there because normally the bombs were going over things and then they spontaneously didn't. It just sat on me. Actually, I don't want that. So we're going to go ahead and reroll. Um so yeah, that was a little bit weird. That was just a weird way for Epic or for uh, Dr. Fetus to su suddenly mo uh, move. I tried firing a bomb at the incoming hopper and the bomb just didn't leave the rocks. Um hmm Luck down. Not too happy about that. But that's fine. Money equals power. Okay, so that's an item uh, that I'm typically interested in. And uh, that's an item that will actually work for me. I actually like this. So this helps me make up the damage that I'm going to have to give up uh, by not going deal with the devil this run. So what we need to do is we need to find ways to make uh, make money. Can you stop doing that? Okay, it's just spamming that. There we go. So we need to find ways to make money. Like not paying him. So we're going to be, yes, come to me my money. Come to me damage ups. Hmm. To be honest, I'm actually more likely to blow him up than I am to pay, uh, play him. Sitting here thinking about that Dr. Fetus early death, and I'm sitting there going, man, if that guy had just not hit me early, I would have been fine. Okay. So I can't go into my shop. I mean, it would be... The shop would be hard-pressed to give me something I would want to spend money on in the first place. I also have no key, and I have no money in the first place. So, you know, lots of good reasons why I can't go to the shop anyways. But, so we got AAA battery. So the final charge on any uh, charge item I have will automatically fill itself. Oh, good. We got Ragman again. I haven't seen a lot of Ragman lately. Okay, so we just got hit. That's not fun. Keep throwing your head. I like it when you throw your head. I don't like it when your head rolls in a way that I can't hit, though. So don't do that, please. And don't do that. Don't fire at me. Just throw your head. Yeah, don't do that. Also, don't... Okay, especially don't create... Two spiders that I now have to dodge. 
Okay, come on. Just a little bit more. Just a little bit more. Just a little bit more damage. Don't create more spiders. Okay, can you just fall over, please? Okay, he's dead. That's fine. You're dead. That's fine. And one more. Good. Uh, screw 100% on board with it. Like, that's, that's an item that's fantastic. Okay, Curse the Blind. I don't really like Curse the Blind. Likes to screw with me. Oh god, I'm so glad that we got screw. <coughs> I feel like I have not been seeing a lot of tears ups lately, so... And the screw is actually a pretty good tears up. It's so nice to see it. You know what happened recently? A breaking run. I need to get on that. Had something that could have been. Didn't turn out to be. <coughs> okay, you just sit right there. Right there. And now your turn. Okay, I kind of don't want to go up into the bigger room. Oh, hey. Hello there. You can be either result. Okay. I was actually hoping for a counterfeit penny. I'll be honest with you. But I am okay with this result. Okay. And we are getting plenty of money. I believe it's every 10 cents is the damage up. So we already have one uh, damage up, technically. And we're working our way towards another one. Is that it? Good. Another penny. Excellent. And I don't necessarily mind going to the shop to see what they have, but it's going to be kind of unlikely that I'm actually going to pick it up, whatever it is. Nice. Money, money, money. Give me more. Give me more monies. Remember, very unlikely that we will be taking the deal with the devil on this floor, because we do have to be able to get uh, some way to get into Mega Satan. I don't know what this is. Anti-gravity tears. Okay. Um, hmm. I'll be honest, this result does not thrill me. I kind of expected to have uh, some item like this that I wasn't going to be happy with, because that t tends to happen to me lately. On Curse the Blind Rooms. Now, you never know. I mean, we could have some really good stuff happen. But, um... This is just not a fantastic item. Okay. Uh, do I already have small rock? I do not. Uh, I don't really care. Okay. Ow. Okay, that's not good. This makes it really hard to aim at Dingle. Okay. So, PJs does not do anything for me. Uh, and, unfortunately, um, I can't take these because I need to get my deal with the Angel. Uh, so, I'm not going to even know what I passed up, which is both good and bad. It's uh, bad because, you know... Could have passed something really good that I could have kind of said, screw it, I'll go for it, and we'll see if I can just make something happen. On the plus side, I don't know what I missed, so, you know. I mean, I could just tap and shoot, but... Okay, so... Guess we'll kind of do this then. Because our damage is not quite good enough to kill these guys quickly. <clears throat> Guess I'll just be right here behind my wall of hate. Awesome. It's not very often that I actually get a room like this with uh, 
stuff that I can actually, that you normally can't get with, with flying when I actually have flying. And I've commented on that in the past. Usually I don't get this room. So I do get like, you know, the beat of heat sort of thing going on here. Oh, nice. Please be good. No. Please be good. Wonderful. Doesn't help me at all. What do we got in here? Anything good? No. Not a huge fan of our current uh, pill layout that I've seen so far. It's not bad. There's just nothing amazing in it so far. So we just got a pretty large damage upgrade from that, as you can see from the increased size of our tiers now. Still looking for our item room. Okay. Kind of scared me for a second there, running around with no extra health, but okay. And you can die. Wonderful. We'll go ahead and go and he I'll go ahead and fight Chubb. Why do I have two of the exact same uh, champion here? It's kind of frightening. Just because this champion shoots. Okay. Let's wait for Chubb to come in my direction. Which he will eventually. Okay, so we'll just kind of take our time with this a little bit. Make sure that we, you know, take out whatever we can. Chubb, could you die, please? Okay, Chubb hit me, but that's fine. This is the only enemy left, and I'm way off to the side of him. Damage plus range up from Synth Oil is actually really good for us. So, not only is it a little bit of a damage up, but the range up is going to be incredibly helpful, I think. So, now we need to go, and we need to find our item room. Thankfully, even though I do have this D4... Um, okay, that sucked. Even though we have this D4, I don't really have any intention of re-rolling. Like, there's not been a reason to. Okay, let's just wait for this guy to come down here. And we can take care of the rest of them. Awesome. So we're going to get a Rune of Algis. So we're going to get some resistance going on here. Um, that could be useful on, like... I don't know, something in the future. Hello. Damn. And we didn't lose anything due to that, thankfully. And these poops are being more, uh, more jerks than usual lately. Come on. Anything interesting? Wafer doesn't do a damn thing to for us, actually. Okay, so we want to keep on exploring. Hopefully, we'll be able to find something. I mean, right now, we're not finding any good reason to uh, um, re-roll or anything like that. Which, I mean, you'd have to give me a really good reason to drop... Um, to drop the Holy Mantle in the first place. And, you know, we're not finding that. Okay. So, we don't know what that is. That's a luck up. I'll happily take it. It's not a luck up. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. And I wish there's something I could do here, but we can't. Um, this, uh... There's just nothing we can do. Okay, we'll go ahead and leave. That is fine. Oh, it's been a peaceful run so far. 
Not a lot going on. I'm not going to bother looking for the top secret room. Instead, we're just going to head off. Just, just slowly, gently, you know? Okay. Flooded Caves 2. Let's see what naughtiness we can discover. Okay, what you got in here? Mm, sure. <coughs> Not too bad of a fight. Yeah, I was gonna say I probably shouldn't sit right there. Uh, we'll go ahead and take the dead dove. Um, I need to blow this up. And that up. Okay, I really was not hoping for that. That up. And that up. Okay, oh crap. It got me with a shot just as I was trying to escape. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, okay. Okay. That's fine. Do that. Oh god, that was close. Uh, okay. So close. We're close. We're almost done. We're almost done. We're almost done. So close. Just don't do something stupid. Okay. Gotta keep peace with number one. Great. Wow. Okay. So first key piece has been achieved. That was incredibly frightening, I gotta be honest. Uh, taking that early hit off of the, um, off the psychic fire was, uh, scary at best. Like, that was, that was frightening. It really was. Okay. Oh, we don't want that. Definitely don't want that. Let's go see what's going on in the arcade here. Excellent. Come on. Okay, I can just sit here for the rest of this. So he didn't really give me anything good, unfortunately. Though the pill might be good. Just gotta keep an eye on my shield. Because when it wears off, I need to get the hell away from this thing. Okay. That's fine. Pretty big damage upgrade right there. Speed up, size down, and a tears up. Pretty nice. Uh, the other two, I may or may not do anything with, depending on uh, how lucky we get, uh, what we find, things like that. Okay, I mean... Okay. Good. And holy light. That's awesome. That just gives us a pretty sizable increase in damage for what we land. And now I can kind of kite happily. What do we got going on here? Four is a uh, reroll. This is actually really good. We'll leave the four there for now. Uh, maybe we'll find something, you know, an item pedestal or something like that. Um, damn it. God damn it. Ah, uh, damn it. I'll see you guys next time.